Okay, let's look at question number 11 on the MAP 1033 final exam review. This question is going to give you a picture of a graph, and it's going to ask you two questions. The graph represents the function y equals f of x. First, it's going to ask you to find f of 0, and then secondly, it's going to ask you to state the domain of the graph. So let's look at the picture. All right. Here is our function. Notice that it starts at negative 4, and it goes to the right. And notice that it touches the y-axis at 2. So I've highlighted those spots for you. You're asked to find f of 0. Remember that 0, this number right here, is an x value. So what I teach my students is to look on the x-axis, because 0 is an x value, find 0, and then walk up or down to get to the graph, because up or down helps me find the y value. Well, obviously here, you would have to walk up. And when you walk up, where do you hit? What y value do you come to? You come to the y value 2. Therefore, f of 0 is equal to 2. The last question asks me to find the domain of this graph. Remember, domain means x. What can we put in to this function? What x values does it eat? Okay. What can you feed it? Well, the way I teach my students to find domain is I teach them to scan, take an object like a pen, scan the graph from left to right. If I start at my leftmost boundary, okay, the vertical scan, that would be the number negative 4. And notice that I continue scanning forever to the right, which means I'm going toward infinity. So that helps me get the answer. The domain of this graph, domain means x. You always scan from left to right. You would be going from negative 4 and including it. That's why I put a bracket, including negative 4 and going forever to the right. The graph does not stop. We will put the symbol infinity to note that, and we'll put a paren. And that would be my domain. All right. Remember, if you're asked to find the range, which is the y value, you would turn the pen and you would scan horizontally from bottom to top.